so in order to make a Punnett square, first things first, you're going to make a square. You're going to have two rows and two columns. Uh, and what you're going to do is you're going to take, you're going to split up your little formula saying uh, what the genes are and put one in one column, one in the other. So this is the leatherback, so he's got a capital L and his lowercase l. This is for the normal female, lowercase l, lowercase l. And what ends up happening is you bring this down. So the lowercase, or the capital L, comes down here and here. Lowercase l goes across here and here. And what ends up happening is you get a square. And for every single egg that's laid, you have a 50-50 chance of having leatherbacks and normals. So if these were adults and not babies, you would have your leatherback to normal. And about half the babies that came out would be leatherback and the other half would be normal. And that's it. That's all you have to do to make a Punnett square. It really is that simple. We have several books that have great tutorials on how to do them for things like ball pythons, corn snakes, even leopard geckos. Uh, so this should help you start to figure out what happens if you cross uh, two different animals. For more information uh, and to pick up the books that have these kinds of tutorials in them, go ahead and visit our website at www.llreptile.com.